right, everybody, we can go ahead. Uh, Christian Clark. Hey, Zion. Um, Stan said that the plan was to foul uh, when you guys were up three at the end of regulation. I mean, did you feel like that message was conveyed clearly uh, before you guys went back out on the court there? Uh, yeah, uh, the message was uh, received, but it's one of those things where you got to be focused. Even when you leave the timeout, you got to be focused to know that once the person puts the ball on the floor, get a quick foul. Um, just got to learn from it, to be honest. That's all I can say. Just got to learn from it. And what do you think's uh, happening to you guys in these late game situations where, you know, you have these leads late and they kind of just slip away or something that we've talked about a lot this season? I mean, we fought back. We was down a lot. We fought back into the game. Uh, but I think it was one of those things where everybody was playing hard. Nobody wasn't playing hard. Everybody was playing hard. Uh, you just got to concentrate and be focused on, you know, the exact thing to do. Hey, Zion, just, just on TV, I mean, it looked like that was a physical game. I mean, out there on the floor, did, did it feel like that was one of the more physical ones you played in this year? Um, yeah, uh, New York is a very physical team. Uh, but, you know, it's all in the game. Uh, I think it makes you know everybody on the court better. It definitely makes you uh, try to be more safer with the ball and not as loose. Um, but, yeah, it was it was a very physical game. And uh, you ended up leaving late in the fourth quarter. Uh, what was that, like a back issue? You took the fall? Uh, you know, is everything like that now? <laughs> nah, it wasn't no back issue. It was uh, one of them little quick cramps. I just jumped on it before I got too late in the game. That's all. I'm good. And and uh, you had the, you, you and Julius were pretty much going at each other uh, the entire night. Obviously, we know you cared more about the wins and stuff like that. But how much do you kind of en enjoy when you can kind of go back and forth with a guy like that and y'all are, you know, matching each other on big things? I mean, you know, I think uh, iron sharpens iron. You know, great players bring the best out of each other. Uh, you know, it is always great to match up against other great players. But like you said, you know me, I just care about the win. Hey, I know it's a different, you know, experience now, but what was it like to finally get to play in the garden uh, in the pros? Uh, I'm glad you asked that, actually. Uh, I mean, New York is the mecca of basketball. Uh, I love I love playing. I love playing here. Uh, I, when I played here in college, and this is my first time playing here in the pros, and I mean, this, this atmosphere, you know, whether they're cheering for you, whether they're booing for you, uh, it's amazing. Uh, uh, honestly, I think outside of New Orleans, obviously, uh, I think this might be my favorite place to play outside of New Orleans. I can't even lie to you. I can't lie to you. All right, thanks, Z. Appreciate your time. No problem. You guys have a good day.